Hey everyone, so today I'm going to be showing you this at home honey face mask. For anyone with acne, scars, or dark spots, this is a great mask to use. So first you're just going to want to have a lemon, and you're also going to want to have some natural or organic honey. So you just want to cut your lemon in half because you're only going to need about half the lemon juice. Then you're going to want to make sure you have a nice clean bowl to mix the ingredients in. So first you're just going to take half of the lemon and just squeeze all the juice into the bowl. Next you're going to want to take two tablespoons of the honey and just mix it into the bowl. Now just you want to mix the lemon juice and honey together until you get the consistency that you want. I made mine a little bit more liquidy than thick um, and you can also just add more honey if you want a thicker consistency. So now you want to make sure you pull your hair back because this mask gets really sticky if it gets in your hair. So you just want to go ahead and start applying this all over your face. So lemon helps to brighten and exfoliate your skin, which is great for anyone with acne or scars or any dark spots on their skin like hyperpigmentation. And I suffer through that around my cheekbone area just because of old acne scars and everything like that. So this is just a natural source of vitamin C and it's just a nice natural ingredient to use on your face. Also, using honey in face masks is also really beneficial for your skin because it's a natural antibacterial and anti-inflammatory because it helps to absorb the impurities from deep within your pores and your skin. So you can also use honey as just a basic face wash or a toner or even just a mask all on its own. So as you can see, this mask, I made mine pretty thin so it basically just looks like my face is wet. It's kind of like the consistency of a mask you would peel, so you can make it thicker if you like, but I just like how this consistency felt on my skin. So you want to let this set for about 15 to 20 minutes before you wash it off. And then you just want to work with the mask while washing it off and just be really gentle with it because the lemon helps to exfoliate, so you don't want to be too rough with washing it off your skin. So once the mask is completely off, you will notice that your skin will feel much smoother and softer right away, but you want to make sure to follow up with a moisturizer. So I'm just using my Josie Marin Argan Oil and I like this after applying a mask because it's a lot lighter and I just like to pat this all over my face. So this mask will take a few applications to start noticing the difference in any dark spots and scars, but I can tell you that it does really make a difference in your skin texture and appearance. So that is the complete video. Thank you so much for watching and until next time, I will see you in my next one. Bye!